Peace be with you. Welcome back to my channel for another video, another spiritual download. If this is the first time that you are coming across my channel, let me be the first to say, hey there, hi there, hello there. You are more than welcome to like the video, share the video, comment, and or subscribe. Whatever you feel you need to do, I support you in the energy. Be that good, bad, or indifferent. I'm going to need you to keep that same energy here in spiritual court because judgment has already been called on all energies that come to this platform. This is a platform that's dedicated to the creator of all things. Uh, something that I feel kind of morphed itself into what we like to consider spiritual court for cases that are being revealed and or uh, exposed by way of being illuminated. I feel like a lot of these truths by way of clarity have been long overdue. Okay, so if this is the platform for you, then welcome. Hey there, hi there. Like, share, subscribe. Why? Because it helps the channel grow. It really does. It just helps this information get out to other people that might need it. Nevertheless, either way, I support you in the energy. Maybe you want to watch the video in its entirety before you decide to do anything of what I've mentioned. And I respect you for that. That I absolutely will support you in that energy. If you're returning back to the channel, then you are my beautiful, wonderful, amazing soul tribe family. Look at you. So beautiful, so radiant, so shiny, just smiling and laughing and feeling good in 2024. All things are looking really good for you. Listen, you are my family. Listen, we are family. Get up, everybody, and sing. Listen, we are family. I got all my brothers and sisters with me, my real soul tribe family. Listen, we're not going to negate the fact that the ambulance is in the background. <laughs> giving us that spiritual word because we know that everything in our environment is telling us something about something or other. Somebody could be calling 911. It's unfortunate, I'm going to tell you, because as happy as we are, as jubilant as we are in the celebratory energy, it's a beautiful extravaganza in the 5D and above. There are some people that are really in the 5D, baby, stuck in the 5D. They can't ascend to that highest of white light because they refuse to come up out of the dark, right? Shape shifted their self permanently into darkness. It's a horrible existence, but that's just an immediate download. Let's just see what the cards have to say. I've already called in my appropriate protection. I pray that all of you that are here have done the same. Just remember that this particular platform is dedicated to the divine. So by coming here, just energetically, by way of looking at the work, you are being sworn in in spiritual court to see the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. So help you creator of all things and what you decide to do with that is totally up to you. But just know that you are being held accountable by way of your intentions, be that verbal, silent, and physical or spirit, absolutely being held accountable. Let's go ahead and get into the spiritual word. Holy Spirit, why am I getting 911? Why am I getting 911? King of Cups, Page of Pentacles, okay, Five of Pentacles. Something's going on and it's not good. Somebody could really be in some trouble. Ace of Cups in the reverse. Somebody's emotionally blocked. This could have something to do with their heart. Whenever I think about being emotionally balanced, I think about the heart. I think about a forgiving heart. I think about a heart that is willing to heal. King of Cups is here. Okay. Somebody's feeling empty. Somebody really could be going through something. Okay, Page of Pentacles, Capricorn Energy, Virgo, Taurus, King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Ace of Cups in the reverse. <sighs> Somebody's going through something real serious by way of financial lack. They could be spazzing out, having some type of emotional outburst. Somebody's really angry that they're losing at what we like to consider the game of life. And I'm just being honest. Somebody feels like they can't get a break. But I feel like this is something that somebody did to themselves for a sword. Again, I'm getting something wrong with somebody's heart. 
Okay, somebody could have wanted to try to make something happen to you and it came back on them. Heavy on the Queen of Pentacles energy. Okay, you could be a Queen of Pentacles, a Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. Okay, this could also be somebody's mother. Why am I getting that energy? 911. Ooh, the ancestors have stand have a. Uh, I was gonna say, will the real ancestors please stand up? <laughs> I meant to say the ancestors are standing up. Yeah, defending us. And I don't mean to laugh. It's not a light situation. I'm really laughing at myself with myself. The chariot in the reverse and the nine of swords. Ooh, in the reverse. Somebody wanted you to be in some type of mental, mental turmoil. Excuse me. Somebody's lacking direction. Somebody's completely lost. They don't know which way to go. Somebody's having an emotional breakdown. Okay. Somebody could be sick. Somebody could have just gotten some news about something. Yeah. Deep-seated trauma, turmoil, uh, internal battles, fears, dark secrets. They're worried. Somebody's scared that their secret's going to come out. They feel like you know High Priestess is coming up in the upright. To a sword, somebody wanted you blinded from something that was the truth about them. Somebody feels stagnant, I just heard. Running from their karma. Somebody could really be on the run. I just heard it's a dark day in hell for those who lost their way. Damn. Damn. Somebody's struggling on their journey. But I feel like they've completely and totally given up. Somebody could be going through some type of financial lack. And that's really stressing them out. Five of Pentacles also represents being spiritually left out in the cold as well. The Emperor, Aries energy. Okay. Somebody's watching you get respect. You're a leader, stable. This could be a father figure. Yeah, somebody's watching you heal from something that somebody uh, put you through. I'm getting like inflicted on you, like an inflicted wound or some sort of some sort. Somebody's saying, I don't want to talk about it. OK, somebody's keeping a lot of their energy, a lot of their secrets pent up. Yeah. Three of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, and or Piscean Energy. A lot of water on the board and fire. Show me what I need to see. Pisces is here. Scorpio, Pan Cancer. Yeah, there's the, all the water signs. Will of Fortune, Karma, Knight of Swords, the Lovers, Gemini Energy, Six of Wands. Somebody's watching you get some type of a victory. This could very well land somebody in the hospital, I just heard. Or they're going to the hospital. Like, somebody is stressed out. Four of Swords and the Five of Pentacles, though, is being left out in the cold mentally, physically, spiritually, financially. Being abandoned, Six of Wands, all while you're sitting here with this victory is too much for somebody to take. You could be a King of Cups, okay? Or a Queen of Pentacles, or maybe there's a Queen of Cups and a, a, a water sign and a Capricorn, okay, heavy on the Capricorn energy by way of the Page of Pentacles that could be together. This could be your emperor. Somebody is really pissed off about this, okay? Or you could be a Virgo choosing a water sign or a water sign choosing a Virgo. There is an emperor here, a lover's, the lover's card. So Gemini energy, you could have a choice between two lovers. One of these lovers is not feeling good. The sun is here. Somebody's saying, you make me happy. I feel like the day you walked away from this person, you took the sunshine away. Something about no light. Like it's a dark day in hell for this person. The will of fortune represents karma. Somebody's saying there's nothing stopping me. The knight of swords, like something's like, somebody does not want to give up on something. Somebody really should give up on something. Something could lead to a 911 call. The empress, somebody's saying you're caring, loving, and kind. We've been getting a lot of this energy, y'all. No matter what deck I pull from, I got a whole bunch of decks. 
I've been pulling a very similar energy, which lets me know that by way of this shift, this transfer of wealth and power to us and us calling back all of our power, our light and our love, it is leaving some people in a drought, energetically in a drought. Okay, is what I'm getting. Damn, this is deep. Knight of Cups. Somebody wants to come in and they've been doing black magic. Look, mental magic at that. Somebody's been doing something to affect somebody's psyche. Yeah, manipulating energy. The magician's in the reverse with the nine of swords in the upright or eight of swords. Rather, I do apologize. Somebody wanted to bind themselves to you and trap themselves uh, in this cavern with you. It's like, yeah, you know. They're in hell. They want you to be in hell. It's like, ooh, we know. God forbid it. Manipulation. Somebody's very insecure. Somebody abused their power. Somebody's coming up as a knight. Somebody's all over the place. Um, this knight of cups, though, I do believe is a new person, though. I don't feel like this is flighty energy. This is something romantic coming in, and somebody knows that somebody's coming in to love you. Three of cups. Somebody feels like they're the third party. Or maybe they put you in a third party and now the, they feel like the tables have turned. I'm getting destiny, a turning point. Something that's inevitable. Yeah, look, the past. The past is now the present. The present is now the past. For somebody, they're having to deal with what it is they've gone through. Listen, let's have a commercial break. What in the hell is going on? What is going on? Somebody is saying, you're not moving forward without me. The hell I ain't. What are you talking about? What is this? Somebody's just having a lot of negative self-thought, loss. This black magic is backfiring. You know, somebody is, is, is heavy with the narcissistic energy, with the magician in the reverse. Somebody was definitely abusing their power, channeling a lot of dark energy, okay, Somebody's not confident in their work, though. So now they put themselves in the eight of swords. Somebody could be literally going to jail. Somebody could somebody could be going to jail. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. A Capricorn could be significant. Heavy on the Capricorn. Okay. Virgo. No, Capricorn. I'm getting Capricorn heavy. That page of Pentacles with that Queen of Pentacles is giving me Capricorn. You could be a Capricorn lady. Okay. With the King of Cups, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, man. Okay, heavy on the Piscean energy, heavy on the Cancerian energy. Somebody just got a lot of water in their chart. And even if they're not these signs and it resonates, uh, somebody's ass is going to jail on the commercial break or after the commercial break or whatever. But somebody's ass is going to jail. Show me what else I need to see, please and thank you. Yeah, Queen of Cups in the reverse. This could be somebody's mother. Somebody that's not happy emotionally. Let me put that back, y'all, because I think my cards were flipped up, upside down. Well, let's just take it the way it came, because I think my cards honestly were flipped upside down. Some of these are not in order, and I don't like that. Yeah, what the hell is going on, though, y'all? Queen of Cups, heavy on the Scorpio Pisces Cancer, so, so, so you're in a union. Okay, thank you, Spirit, for clar clarifying that. Somebody's in a union, King of Cups, Queen of Cups. In the upright. Okay. Thank you, spirit. I'm being guided to keep it in the upright. Let me just make sure these cards are so tiny, y'all. They were going the right way, but I think one shuffle too many put them in the wrong direction. <laughs> you know it's going to be somebody in the comments. I knew it. Oh, shut up. You're just looking for somebody to lie to you. Okay. And tickle your ears, baby. The truth is the truth. No matter how you flip it, spin it, rub it down. Oh, no. She only shuffled the left side two times and the right side once and a half. You don't sit down with your ain't got nothing to do ass. Hold on. <laughs> I love y'all though. I love you, you little wicked bastards. Listen, queen of cups to the king of cups. Somebody knows that you got some type of union coming in, baby. Somebody's violent. Somebody's angry about this. Show me what I need to see, please and thank you. Strength, Leo energy, your power. Sun energy, you're happy. Something about you having courage. 
Somebody could have wanted to instill like some type of fear in you by where this magic. Somebody wanted you mentally trapped in your head, all that. It's a no, my friend. You're coming up as fire. You're coming up as compassionate. You're coming up in this really beautiful inner strength type of an energy. Somebody's really focused. And this, the fact that this partnership is coming in has really got somebody's ass in a funk. Yeah, there's a fight, baby. Somebody's going to jail. Five of Swords, I don't know who this is or who they're fighting with. Maybe because you're not around for them to fight with. But somebody's ass is going to jail, period. Eight of Swords is jail. Five of Swords is fighting, conflict. This could be literal conflict in a real 3D world. Somebody is pissed off and they could want to throw hands and a whole bunch of other things. Listen, sneaky and deceptive though. They think that they're getting away with something and they're not. I feel like that's towards the universe. You're at a distance. You're moved away from this person. Somebody knows that you got something good coming in and baby, they are mad about it. Somebody wanted to taint your image, destroy your reputation. Now they look crazy. Somebody could have had a lot of people watching you, okay? And now they're looking real stupid. Somebody wanted to like taint your image, okay? And say things about you. I'm getting rumors or something like that. And now somebody could be getting into fights with the people that they tried to turn against you. This is all energy though. They could have gotten other people to do magic over you too. Like the moment you got to go into a group. Yeah, somebody's ass is going to jail. Justice is here, period. Whatever they got going on, it's going to be some type of argument, dispute. This could be today, tonight. Um, I'm recording this on a Friday. So I'm feeling like this is when this is going to happen. Justice. The Five of Swords conflict. Somebody was looking for you to fight. Somebody wanted to cause some type of chaos to get you in trouble with the law or something. But you're nowhere to be found. You're in this Queen of Cups, King of Cups energy. The black magic is not working. You could have moved away from this reality or wherever they live. And they're trying to figure out where you live. Somebody still believes that you're in the same place, the same location. So they're like working that location by way of energy. Okay. Five of Swords and the Eight of Swords is jail. That's fighting, conflict, disruption, conflict. I just keep getting upheaval, okay? I don't really know how else to say it. Somebody doesn't like to lose. Heated debate, heated disagreement, okay? Somebody also could have tried to do something like um, approach you in, in the 3D by way of attacking you or hurting you or something. And now that they can't get to you, I feel like they're just spazzing out with everybody, yeah, Eight of Swords, and you winning? Lord, have mercy. You came up as a son, honey. Lord Jesus, and the High Priestess. Oh, Lord. And they came up as the Magician in the Reverse. Ooh, I just heard blatant narcissism. Ooh, that's a bad thing to be addicted to. Mm -mm. Now, testosterone is one hell of a drug, but narcissism, baby, that's a horrible thing to be addicted to. Like, mm -mm. and you're aware that you're aware that that's how you're coming off? Okay, well, listen, that's your business. Stand in that energy. Support yourself in that energy, baby, because somebody needs to support you. Six of Cups, Scorpio, Pisces, and or Cancer and Energy. This is somebody that you left in the past, okay? This could have been a while ago. Somebody ain't got over it. Somebody can't get over it. They don't know why they're not getting over it. They don't know what the problem is, you know, who the problem is. And at the end of the day, the whole thing is uh, being resolved by way of them being the problem. Okay, here you are in the middle of all of your solutions <laughs> with the King of Cups to the Queen of Cups. Seven of Wands is seven is like spiritually protected on a journey, on a path. Yeah, you on your journey. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles, I can't make it up. No matter what cards I pull, they're all going to come the way. Yeah, Eight of Cups, listen. You walked away from somebody. Good for you. Because if somebody is this mad over the fact that you're not around, mm -hmm, that's a lot going on. Order in the court, honey. What's the outcome on this situation? King of Pentacles. Something about you standing in your stability. Queen of Pentacles to the King of Pentacles. King of Cups to the Queen of Cups. This is an abundant couple, loving, caring, kind, soulmates. Somebody's mad. Somebody's connected to somebody that they left behind. You could have had a choice between two, but obviously one of these people started spazzing out. Somebody could have tried to sneak up on you with this person and, and tried to get into some type of conflict and the police were called. Somebody's about to do some time in jail. Maybe...
don't have enough time there to think about what it is they got going on because something ain't all the way adding up. Two of Wands, you're at a distance. You could have had to move away from somebody. Somebody's trying to hunt you down, find you, find out where you are, you know, maybe asking people around about you, okay? Every time I see Wands, it's fire sign energy for me. Yeah, you're planning. You're making progress. You could be traveling or just doing something different. Yeah, you're inspired. Page of Wands, you're waiting on good news here, okay? You could just stay to yourself. The Hermit, Virgo energy, you go within, you stay to yourself. Somebody sees you as sneaky and deceptive because you're moving in silence. Seven of Swords, okay? So after all of what they did, you got the nerve to be coming up as sneaky and deceptive when really you're just moving in silence like lasagna, okay? My friend, listen, you don't want nobody in your business. You're moving silent. Silently, listen, <laughs> you're taking a leap of faith and that's absolutely beautiful. Boy, boy, boy. Somebody, somebody's going to be calling uh, 911 though. Mm -mm. Yeah. Collaboration. This could have been a group of people. This could have been neighbors because I see, I don't even know if this is an ex of yours. I feel like this is just somebody that was out to get you, that's mad that you're doing well. I don't see that there's really any correlation by way of the lovers or you being with somebody. Somebody's just hating the fact that you're winning and they're not, okay? They got a group of people to collaborate against you, do some type of black magic, and now everybody's looking crazy. And now these people obsessively, compulsively can't stop watching you. So if you have a platform, somebody could have been like, oh, this is her or this is him, you know, talking bad about you. Yeah, this bitch, you know, people make up their lies. They're so angry, so full of hate, you know, so ugly just because they don't like themselves, can't look themselves in the mirror. Now somebody's sitting up crying. That's crazy. In the jail cell, possibly, or they will be. <laughs> I'm like, uh, that's a good place. Like, when, when, when did you have the epiphany? Was it before you consciously started or unconsciously started this conflict? Got your ass into the paddy wagon, also known as the cop car, okay? The police car, whatever you want to call it. The the vehicle, the, the uh, what is this? <laughs> The motor vehicle that is going to be transporting your ass to the Eight of Swords energy by way of jail. Listen, when did you have the epiphany that you needed to drop a tear and go within and really tell the truth that you don't like yourself? Come on. That's not nice. Knight of Wands. We tired of seeing your non-committal ass. I don't know what that's about. But nevertheless, somebody was angry because you got energy. You're positive. You're standing in your truth. And somebody could have tried to track you down, honey. And got, got they ass caught up. Judgment in the reverse, child. Woo! Somebody about to do some time. It felt just like that on my chest. <laughs> like, just like this. So this is how I'm being guided to take it. The judgment. That's not good. That's not good. The moon, a hidden enemy, somebody scared. Yeah, this is a collaboration. Could have been up to five people. Attacking a Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, King of Cups, Queen of Cups. You're coming up as a stable, grounded, emotionally balanced couple. Or this is somebody that you're coming into some type of a union with. And somebody knows that. By way of doing magic, somebody could also be doing some type of divination and abusing divination. So this is how they found out. Well, listen, it landed their ass in jail, if not all of them. But I feel like there's a disagreement amongst their group. Is what I feel. If they were sending spirits of conflict and it didn't work. Okay, maybe your house is just too happy. Maybe you play music. Maybe you dance around. Maybe you got flowers like me and somebody tries to send you some nasty energy. I know the devil comes to my door all the time and looks inside and be like, never mind. <laughs> the devil peeks in my window and I'm like, oh, it's you. I've been waiting. They're like, oh, never mind. <laughs> Because when the devil comes, it can't find nothing to attach itself to in your home. It has to flee. That's a fact. That's just the way it goes. That's reality in a nutshell, in a whole bunch of shells. Listen, this is the message though. I love y'all. I just wanted to do this really quick reading because I'm doing a lot of the personal readings behind the scenes. I'm going to be coming back out with those... Um, Oh, I'm trying to figure it out. 33, 33. What, what was I doing that on Fridays? I think it was for people that really need those readings. So 33, 33. Okay. For readings. So 
Maybe I'll make them 20 minutes. Any of you that really know me, know me, that have gotten a reading from me, you already know. I always go over the time. I do. I do. If you get a 30-minute reading, sometimes it turns into 55 minutes. And you're like, damn, Neff. Well, listen, that's just the way I like to rock and roll. Because if spirit tells me to keep going, I do. And sometimes there's more to the situation. So this is the message. I love y'all, okay? I will see you in the next video. Peace be with you.